everyone welcome to medical dialogues i'm rosh dhidha let's look at today's medical news world's first trial offers new hope for type 1 diabetes up until insulin's discovery more than 100 years ago type 1 diabetes was a fatal condition despite insulin's life saving role the therapy itself is potentially dangerous if too much or too little is administered and the condition still comes with the long term complications including heart attack and stroke vision impairment kidney disease and nerve damage researchers at St Vincent Institute of Medical Research in Melbourne have shown that a commonly prescribed rheumatoid arthritis drug can suppress the progression of type 1 diabetes The world first human trial published in the New England Journal of Medicine and led by SVI's professor Thomas Cav showed that a drug called baricitinib can safely and effectively preserve the body's own insulin production and suppress the progression of type 1 diabetes in people who initiated treatment within 100 days of diagnosis. Are you also aspiring to excel in medical journalism and delve into the intricacies of health and medical reporting? Explore our comprehensive course on medical and health journalism available at the Medical Dialogues Academy. Learn from industry experts who possess in depth knowledge and experience in this field. For further details, scan the QR code provided or access the link in the description box below. Researchers said that when type 1 diabetes is first diagnosed, there is a substantial number of insulin producing cells still present. We wanted to see whether we could protect further destruction of these cells by the immune system. We showed that baricitinib is safe and effective at showing the progression of type 1 diabetes in people who have been recently diagnosed. This groundbreaking research shows promise as the first disease-modifying treatment of its kind for type 1 diabetes that can be delivered as a tablet. Researchers also said that we are very optimistic that this treatment will become clinically available. This would be a huge step change in how type 1 diabetes is managed and we believe it shows promise as a fundamental improvement in the ability to control type 1 diabetes. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for more updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.